Yeah. Wheels up, boys. Wheels up. Everybody strap in. Okay, so Derek just asked us flats or drums. That's how we're starting the second half of this off. Flats or drums, Dumb dog. Drums. Duh. I'm drums all day. I'm flats. See, that's Ash and Hannah. That's a crazy move. I'm definitely drums. But I do respect this about the flats is it seems like you can get more meat off them. Yes. Yeah. Not always true. But but drums are better for you dipping. You got to do a weird thing with your drums are flats. way better for dipping, I don't but like that. Yes. yes. See, that's, I'm, I'm, but if I'm a sauce dippers. dude. Yep. Yeah. Yes, I am Spicy too, garlic but, but dog, on. let's go. Well, hold on. I got this <laughs> I'm telling you guys, I got this way of breaking open a flat and pulling it. So when you pull it, you can just dip that, and the only thing that's in your hand is just that gristle part. See, that's my, my to buddy. To hold it all together. See, but you've already had to take an extra step you don't have to take with the drum. I don't have to pull shit. It's just on a little fucking spindle. Yeah, but the meat is yeah, more tender. You're not, you're not going to get the as much meat. The meat is more tender on a flat feel, than it is on I feel like people a... judge me when I eat the drums because I leave a lot of meat on the bone. I, I leave nothing. You're one of those people. Yeah, huh? I am. I wait am. a minute, wait a minute, so wait a minute. I yelled that by it. But on a drum? Yeah. Yeah. Isn't the meat more... Because it's on the bone, isn't it a little bit more tough? Or you guys don't I think, think I leave like, like I think I you're like right. if you grade it like one, two, three, four, five, like I've seen like on Facebook, I'm probably like a four. Like I, I don't rip it to the bone, but I leave oh, it I a go, little bit. There ain't no oh. I go all the way to the fingertips. I eat it like See, one on the cob. That's not me. I'm a savage. No, I, I leave a lot really? of meat. Yeah. Yeah. Like three, four maybe? Yeah. Yeah. Fucking I'm all about the sauce, man. Yeah. I'm a yeah. sauce, and it's like yeah. you guys I don't, don't like chicken wings, you pieces of shit. No, I do, Dude, I do. Why do you don't like sauce? No, guys, I, what I the don't... fuck are we doing? And last quick question, I know we got to move on. Yeah. Sauce oh, on them or on the side? Side, same. On them, like, oh, on they on get them. too soggy and like yeah. shitty yeah. whenever the sauce is on them. But being a flats guy though, you don't have to dip them, so you can eat them however you want to. Now, Dry rub is okay, good too. Question for all of you: When you eat wings, do you have some to take home? Do you like to have wings to take home? Yeah, I know you. That's what I do on the side. Absolutely. I hate if it. I'm gonna eat yeah. ten wings, I'm gonna order twenty. Soggy by the time you I'll order them. forty-four at air fryer. Dubs, and guess air what? fryer, change your whole life. Eat. Air fryer. I like forty-four yes. at B Dubs. Yes. One sitting. You've seen it. I yeah. don't fuck around. I, you've Irresponsible. Seen it. <laughs> like yeah. That's I don't like leftovers. I don't even like the idea. You know what I mean? I don't like the idea of leftovers. Leftovers, really? So yeah, it's crazy about Drewski. He'll eat forty-four, puke in the parking lot, and then fucking want more to go. Family, yeah. We we have families to feed, man. Like come on, no. Sometimes you overdo it. Sometimes you're a little bit of a glutton. Sometimes you're like, <laughs> every time, not sometimes, <laughs> every you, time. I have to finish them. You know I am. I have to eat them. They can't have some for later. It's like a, it'll drive me crazy. I'll get home and I'll eat them. If you ever see me box it up wings, does. It's weird. They don't last overnight. Cause I'm like, they're just. Why do you box them up? Because they're lonely in the fridge. You know what I'm saying? Lonely. You know, me and the, Cal the, was talking <laughs> about this today. I, I stopped up to see our boy Cal, man. Cal doing shout out to Partyville. We, uh, I, I went up there and we were just talking about um, because he's he's. 50 days no drinking it's fit it's his 50th day today no shit not he drinking. looks great too and he's like he looks really good he's been he's been on the treadmill he's been working out and we were talking about stuff and he said uh you know one of the biggest things was when he drinks he just loves to eat he has yep. these yeah <laughs> he has these drunk munchies right yeah, yeah. and um yeah. And, I mean, and well so when you take something home we talked about this like Okay, so you go out to so I was saying like oh I go out to Larson's I'm probably not even hungry right then I'm drinking beer I'm doing mm-hmm. right but I'm like you know what man I'm gonna take the chicken wings to go home right yep. ah fuck it you know I'm gonna get some cheese sticks too you know Sam Sam what if Sam wakes up and she's hungry I'll get some I'll get some chicky tendies right I'll and then I'll, well, I'll get some mini tacos <laughs> right just in case you some popper so now I got five things I go home you know what I mean yeah and you yeah just, and then if Sam's not up. 99% of the time, Sam's not up when I get home. So, of course, I'm just going to devour everything. So, you're like me. Yeah, they might as well be sending text messages from the fridge. Come get me. Because I'm like, in my head, I'm like, they're in there. The dirty talk text like Drewski gets is from the fridge, Chicken not wings. from a woman. Chicken wings. I'm all sauced up for you, baby. And I'm fucking on it, dude. I, they, they, they're still warm sometimes. I'll bring a box home. They're still warm when I eat them, when I take them home. I swear to God. Because they, no. they can't sit there. Like, when I'm drunk... Like and yes, I will heat up. Like if I if I just get to the point where I can't eat no more, it is what it is. I'll heat it up, eat it up in the air fryer the next day or something. And it's fucking delicious. But I can't not stop eating. Me neither. Like uh, bar yeah. food, and it's just yeah. chicken wings for me because nothing else makes it out of the restaurant. If it was I steaks just, or something, it'd be different. He knows this about me. I don't leave food at the restaurant. My what about you, plain. Mikey? What's that? Can you can you control yourself or what? <laughs> I can't right now. I See, just... I can. I can. 
Mike. No, is, no, I, he's like, no, yeah. I can't control myself about something else. I'm thinking about. Oh, on yeah. that, yeah, absolutely. Yeah. Like I love leftovers, so the next day, yeah. like I'll take another shot instead of eating. Yeah, same. And then same, I'll like same. the next day hangover. The I need them wings, and I need a. Are you thinking about the refrigerator? Need a, I'm thinking about the refrigerator. I'm thinking about your wings that I kicked. I'm thinking about all kinds of shit. Like I'm. <laughs> See, yeah, right let's now. talk about this, man. Let's talk about this. Derek asked us off air about the fucking <laughs> wing kicking situation, and we've talked about this before. But he wanted to know what happened after that or before that. I guess what, what transpired that night to make that happen, that event happen. Is that what you were asking? What event? Well, when so I we kicked were just at the TJ's bar. wing, birthday party, wings. somebody's birthday. I forget. When I kicked it was, TJ's it was, wings. My, it was our birthday. It was between my birthday and his birthday. Okay, so, so we were, we're out celebrating, birthday, and right. you wanted to get fucking stupid shots after we were already doing all no, the no, stupid these shots. No, no, these assholes. So they started off. I had tequila, vodka, right? Mm-hmm. On like, well, fuck you guys. You want to switch it up? I drink whiskey, so we'll do mine too. After whiskey, I don't know why I haven't smoked. He's a different person sometimes. <laughs> because I was behaving and then we did, that night. Then we did people wanted to fuck with me that night. Oh yeah, Jake got us tequila. That's what fucked us up. Every we conversation mixed, Mike had just seemed to sour him a little more. So let's just, we can go Zoom there. By the end of the night, he was, he didn't want to cure what people had to say anymore. And that's not Mikey. Like, you can tell Mikey's off when he's just like, yeah, okay. And it's like, oh, he's not even listening. No, Mikey's pissed. So you guys oh, and there. we had that fucking chick in your ear. I won't, I won't talk about who it was about. or who was yeah. kept going the longest. Yeah. It made it almost like a, a battle. But Mikey, when he's in a battle, he has to win it. Right, Mikey, like, will win a, a battle of words, you are fucked. Because he'll get sharp-tongued, he'll get mean if he has to. He don't like to lose when he's mad. Go for the throat. If you, <laughs> I if ain't you, fucking around with little I'm jabs. With, I'm with it. Like, imagine all night long, for some reason, this night was super bad. I had people say it to him. Everybody was like, what's up, Tito's? They're like, hey, I just ordered a Tito's and Coke. And he was just like, "Really?" normally that don't bother him. It, it never bothers when, me. When, when is this? This was one at his birthday at Larson. So this was every series of unfortunate events that could happen to Mikey to piss him off. Like, usually it'd be like this. Like, Mikey can brush that off. You say that Tito's comment, he don't give a shit. This night, this was after somebody stayed in his ear all night long. Like, it was just on him for, it seemed like the minute we sat down. And even when he, like, tried to, like, see common ground, she would seek out violence. <laughs> she just would go all the other way. And Mikey would finally just had enough. Then he ran into one of our boys, who also soured the even worse. Like, it just... It just kept going downhill. Mm-hmm. Take it away with the wings, boys. Funny, crazy. Mikey got this mad though. Go ahead, TJ. You guys got two versions of the same story. I'd love to hear yours, TJ. He just he ended up. Uh, we I've said it before. I'll just I'll say the short version of it. He went outside and I let him go outside and cool off. I know that when we're at the homie spot, he can go outside and he's protected. It's not like we were somewhere foreign. So I let him get a, some seconds, some minutes. And then I said, man, it's been a minute. I better go check on him. I go outside. And it just so happened as I'm about to walk outside, Alex hands me my wings. And it's like, well, fuck it. I'm, I'm not, I'm not going to sit on some stranger's table as I'm on the way outside. So I have my wings with me. Now, here's, here's, here's where my mind goes. I'm going to check on my boy. There's two things that could happen. I can set my wings down. They're in a bag. I can set them on the ground next to the door. Ain't nothing going to happen to them and go check on my homie, right? Or I can put them on somebody else's car, right, and now create more problems than there already is. That's where my mindset is Mm -hmm. because I'm having fun. I'm cool. What I needed to do required two hands. I had to give my homie... Some love. You know what I mean? It's a hug. Hey, bring it in, bro. We're good. We're good. N- nothing was going on with me and him, but sometimes you just need somebody. Who, who is the homie? Mikey. Okay. So so sometimes. I was already fine. Yeah. Sometimes. <laughs> That's not true. Uh, he wasn't. <laughs> he wanted to go back in. But sometimes, yeah, he was still, when I walked out, he was still I motherfucking people. I hear you, Mikey. <laughs> Those people might as well have been so, the wings. Like, so he, me, he was ready for round homie, two. You know how it is with your homie? Like, sometimes you got to embrace them and let them know, hey, man. Yeah. Everything's yeah. fine. Your home is like, everything's fine. We're good. Everything's fine. It was one of those moments. And what did you do, Mikey? You was cool as a cucumber. I said, yep. You I've were been like, fine. yeah, no, nah, man. Everything's fine. We good. Oh, yeah. We good, I don't man. Care. I'm just, and you did, you you said a couple fr- things that you were frustrated about just so I understood furthermore for when we go back inside so I knew what the fuck was going on. Because that's what homies do. Nobody wants to be leave their homies in the dark just in case shit pop off. Am I, am I lying? Correct. Cool, we man, we hey, we like this. 
walking walking back to the door. We like this. I'll agree with a, that part. But we yep. had a strut, and then this fool looks down, <laughs> sees the bag of wings, and then just boots him and goes, "Who the fuck <laughs> sets their wings on the ground? Fucking idiots!" Hell yeah. Not even or true. No, you didn't say idiots. Not you even said true. something. I didn't even say. Said, I'm happy now. Walking back into the bar, happy we're gonna continue our like night. This. I see a package, which is a to-go box, on yep. the ground. Yep. Public parking lot. So I'm drunk and thought it was a good idea. Let's kick this fucking box towards the door. Hell yes. Gotcha. <laughs> this is such a... Come uh, to find Michael out, they're his wings. This is Why a, would you put your wings on. on the floor? Hold on, let's go back. Hey, Derek, ever. Derek, Mikey, hold on. Mikey, Mikey. Hey, Green Bay needs a kicker. <laughs> Bad. <laughs> And if you kick the fuck out of those wings, let's go, dude. Three I fucking Derek, Derek, straight to the door. Stri- I mean, he did, but here's hey. hold on. No, here's the hey. thing. I didn't know they were his here's wings. The thing that gets lost though in this conversation or this whole story. Here's the thing that always gets lost. Not once, not once was I like, Mikey, what the fuck, man? No, I just went. Those those are my wings, man. And then I Cole, immediately Cole felt was cool, and he was like. Oh fucking! You were. You I felt like, terrible. Damn, I tried picking him up off just, the ground and putting him back in the box. Like, Why? He wouldn't need him oh, at yeah, that point. Yeah. See? He, he tried to put the brains back together like it was fucking yeah. JFK in the and the fucking Lincoln. Refused Lincoln. to eat him. Like you know what I mean? Like, <laughs> he like, refused like, to eat like, him at that point. You, 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 you <laughs> guys see this fucking Lincoln story <laughs> when she starts trying to fucking? Yeah. Put the, hey. you know what I mean? So like, I'm like, I'm gonna go back in. I'm gonna buy you new wings. Walk back in. I'm like, Willie, I need some more wings. He's like, Mikey, fryer's done. Fryer, shut off. I'm like, fuck. That that's when you feel terrible. No, it was a great kick. Great kick. Great kick. And These little it. legs had a great kick. God damn. It was a fucking great it, No, it But why would you set your wings on the floor? Hey, you might be one but of the But I explained that. That's the I comment that you that. hate, though, was one Mikey does that to you. And he's like, why, why would you, you why put, put your wings on the floor so I could kick but them? But I had a completely good explanation. Right. Fair enough. The explanation one was I could set them to the side. They weren't in front of the door. Hey, Derek, look at me. Look at me so you know I'm for real. Yep. I didn't set him in front of the door. Set him in front of my fucking feet. All I'm saying is... I didn't set him in front of his feet. I set him to the side. If Jordan's going to shoot... Let him shoot. You know? Like, fucking shoot. If Mikey's going to kick, you like, ain't you Let ain't him shit, kick. Dude. Thank let you, brother. Kick, so, dude. thank you. All right. Yeah. You never you know set what? your wing. You ever set a to go box down on the ground? You're never. You're not going to set a I, basketball what? in front of okay. Jordan and okay. tell him not to shoot. Okay. You know? So, okay. So, so. Maybe the, Mikey so might be the best kicker of all fucking time. So, the alternative is what? Put him on somebody's car, right? You put him on your arm like a Or so, just hold him. Hold on. Wait a minute. Yep. Hold him like a purse. Or just if put I walk satchel. out to my car and somebody's got their food sitting on my car, we got a problem. We are next to an old tempo. They would have hey, been bro, all right. I'm not, I'm not putting my wings <laughs> on, the, on the ground. I'm putting them in the fucking car. Thank you. <laughs> Why you got to hate on the four tempo, bro? Because it's busted. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> Set it on the tempo. Wait, was TJ, it a not on the ground. Tempo or did Mercury He's make tempo? Totally full of shit. It was like a black. No, Mal- a it was a black Malibu, and it looked pretty fucking new. Hey, Mikey, Mikey has totally changed his story. I, I, yeah, I, I think what we've <laughs> come I seen to a tempo he yesterday. Such... Actually, yeah. I don't he know. also, well, I can tell you this from knowing Mikey. I think what we've he come to. Cool. He wasn't okay to go back in. <laughs> hey, he yes, I was. He was. What he was doing was being like, "This is for you, TJ. I'm gonna be cool. I'm gonna go back in." But in his head, a little bit of both. No, hundred percent. In his head, yeah, it was. Both. I'll fuck take you. that. He went in. Fuck you. Fuck you. Those people. And he Jake hated. was out there too. Like it wasn't just me. Like Jake was out there. Had already been talking Mikey to him. Mikey, like he life, realized, though. you know what? I'm, I'm ruling my night with I this guy. Say a truer statement about Mikey. Our entire life, if you piss him off, and that the way he was pissed off at certain people that night, he will never ever talk to you again. He will avoid you at all costs, and you're dead to him. This has been his way. So you Family said you members. don't hold grudges, and I wish I was more like that. I'll write a motherfucker off, like. <laughs> And it's not a like, great like, quality like, of mine. It's like not. Taxes. I'll admit that. So like funny. But I write it off. Yeah. Like, I wish I was more like you. I really do try to be. Yeah. I mean, it's like, I, off. I can't. Write it He's off. in a like situation taxes. where you don't write it off. Okay. You want to tell him the, the story of the stadium? We, we go to see Green Bay Packers. We went to Atlanta. And it's already a place he warned me. He's like, Atlanta fans, they don't really cheer for the Falcons. <laughs> they root for them because it's, it's their team. <laughs> yeah. so, so all day, this whole time, I didn't realize fans were this way. I'm going to a game. I'm happy. I went to a Wisconsin game. Everybody was great to everybody, right? Mm-hmm. Even in Detroit. Usually people are cool. We had this guy behind us all night long just running his mouth to us because we, we got destroyed. Packers got Julio Jones just made us look so stupid. It was the NFC Championship. Yeah. And it was Julio, like 40, 45 to I know like what 20. You guys are talking about. Yeah. He had two touchdowns, yeah. like 160 yards. Yeah. Something crazy. Yeah. And this guy was wearing a jersey and he's like a Rolodex of information. So we know what, who the jersey was. So I mean, this, this guy's been talking shit. So he's like, Who's jersey wearing? 
And the guy didn't know. He's like, you fucking idiot. Like, he's mad now. And then Ashley's like, you two got to shut the fuck up. And I'm like, I wasn't even saying nothing. And yeah, right. he just got roped in. But, but yeah. she ha- to her credit, we have got, our, our group of friends have got riled up in places before yeah. and caused a scene. So yeah. she didn't want a scene. Well, the guy kept going. And we were being quiet. We shut up. Listen. And then Ashley's like, you pizza face motherfucker. Go get some acne cream. And the kid was like, sat down and watched the rest of the game and didn't say where it was. So we've already had this moment where I know he's worked up. Right, okay. you can't make this shit up. We had to go sit through that game. Like we stayed the entire time because we paid for tickets, and it got like it was like forty two to twenty four or something. <laughs> it was bad <laughs> enough to where Atlanta fans felt bad for us. Hey, we got a cheek slap. <laughs> Atlanta fans were like, "Good on you guys for staying." Until one fan, you want to tell them what happened to you? Mm-hmm. We're walking out of the stadium. We're going down. This guy takes Derek's hat. Now this is just me and Derek. Ashley left us. She was pissed. She's like, "I'm going to the car." I've had enough of this game and you guys. We're walking out. Some guy takes Derek's hat. Now, at the time, I didn't know this. That's not Derek's hat. Ashley's mad at us. Somebody just took Ashley's hat, Green Bay hat, and said, what are you going to do? And I can't even make it up this guy's face. And Derek's looking up at him because we're here. He, he's here. I'm up ramp. I'm on down ramp. And he took the hat. And Derek's just looking up at him. And it reminded me of the, the fishing pole. The guy, you know, he pulls the money back. Got to be I, quicker than that. Yes. 100%. <laughs> where he's like... Pulling the dollar away. <laughs> and he kept doing it to Derek, and Derek jumped twice. And finally, I just see him, and he puts his head down, and he starts walking back up the thing. I was like, God, this guy's oh, happen. No. So all hell breaks loose, right? Derek does, when he's that mad. Hey, hold on. But it, I love that he just said, he came to terms with, this got to happen. Yep. Yeah. I so respect that. I, I had to go. had that moment where it's like, fuck. I, I'll get, I gave him space, because I knew how, he was even madder at me. Like, he's been a Packers fan forever, so he, I was walking ahead, and I was like, he's pissed. Let's look. He needs... So I had to turn around and run back up. Because this guy's not alone. This guy's with 14 people, right? But Derek don't care. This guy get Ashley's hat back. Goes up there. For sure, I, I won't get into too many details. The 14 people were allowed to stay. Me and Derek were asked to leave. Like, security thought it was bad enough on them. They already had enough problems. You two are in trouble. You got to leave. Needless to say, didn't get his hat back. They ripped his overalls that he got at an actual Packers game. Like, he's really nice... Packers overalls. So he's already like stupid. Stripes? Oh, yeah. You had the stripes. <laughs> yeah. so I still it. do. But the worst was Ashley was like, hey, where's my hat? And yeah. I was like, ah, I left it. And she's like, <laughs> this is my favorite hat. And she's like, you didn't even like fight for it? And I That's was like, the worst part. I was like, no. Damn. I was like, no. Like, I know you don't want us to fight. And she's like, you pussy. <laughs> oh, shit. And then, and then I was like, Actually, me and Andy beat up everybody. <laughs> and she's like, you're so immature. And I was like, what do you want to do, dude? <laughs> I was like, you wanted me to fight? You didn't want me to fight? Hey, we... Hilarious. Bottom line, she wanted you to grab that hat. Well, the though. whole way, he's like, we can't tell Ashley we got to go fight. And I was like, what are we going to do about the ripped bibs and hat? She's like, he's like, I'll handle it. Like you can can't talk you, about it. You could say you were drunk and you fell down like the steps or something and it ripped. Like, whooped and ass. You lost the hat. Like, But I was like, you know what's funny? Our friends... And, Our friends have known us forever. This motherfucker told everybody, like, I got my ass put by the like, old dudes. <laughs> <laughs> he still tells it to this day. Our friends still think we went to that game and got whooped. Like, we got in the car, and I was like, yeah, Ash, we did get in a fight. And Derek got his ass whooped. He got stomped out by penny loafers. And Gary's in the front seat. No <laughs> <People>. fucking way! <laughs> <laughs> so all of them are like, Derek, get your ass whooped. And I'm like, bitch. So many jokes about when Derek sees, like, an old lady. He's like, are you okay? Yeah. Are you nervous? <laughs> and you'll be like, are you good? Are you good? <laughs> Ah, uh, but just again though, that's just like moments like of people not letting shit go, even though you think they're okay. Like I thought he was okay. We're walking out of the stadium. You two are very similar in that way. He probably like, was okay until Ashley asked or called him a pussy. Oh, dude, <laughs> Ashley laid face. into me, yeah. laid the fuck into me. She was like, "Hey, where's my hat?" And I was like, <laughs> "I was trying to be cool, and I let the guy have it." And she's like, "You pussy!" And I was like, "Actually, I beat his ass." And she's like, "You're immature." And I was like, "Whoa!" Like, what do you mean? Well, we also what do I do? Do? <laughs> damage we don't. And then on top of that, you already got your ass whooped in the game. Like the yes. game. Yeah. Like, oh yeah. Packers still got there was a bunch whooped, of cool you know moments too. Like we we came ran into the ball guy. Remember? And we were like, so wait. Yeah. Who's it? We it was, actually, about Tom, it was yeah. right when Tom Brady went through that thing about yep. letting the air out of the balls. And we were asking about. It. He's like, oh, that's some NFL secrets and shit. And we talked to the. We seen the whole other tr- Atlanta bus. Like very cool moments, but the moment that is. 
the it was an ass whoop in, yeah, in the was. football game. Yeah. It was ass whoopings. <laughs> well, speaking of ass whoopings, man, I, I love giving out ass whoopings. I mean, I've taken some. Don't get me wrong. I've taken some, but I love giving out ass whoopings. So speaking of giving out ass whoopings, I'd love to give y'all an ass whooping in whatever game you guys got oh, kind of oh, for us. Oh, hell yeah. So, I, so Derek's been talking about this game. First of all, before we get to this game, I think this transpired from a talk you guys had about your new venture, yeah, yeah. podcast da, da, venture, da, Derek. Da, da, uh, dad, da, da, da. <laughs> it's okay. <laughs> About the uh, dad podcast, right? Yeah, yeah. Dad, yeah. The dad yeah. pod. The it's dad up on the pad. screen right now. There goes the new okay. logo yeah. for it, which is super yeah. fucking dope. Let's dad go. pod. Let's go. Shout out to dad pod. Yeah. So we're gonna do uh different games, right? We're gonna do uh what's your opinion on things and so, we're gonna. So, so so the games are pretty fun. It'll be sometimes stream games. Sometimes Derek will uh. Hang back and he'll like kind of like uh, Trebek it, you know, Alex mm-hmm. Trebek. Oh, yeah. He'll, he'll play the role of like, let's talk about it, like get people going, and I'll always be on a team. And losers, we're not going to just do shots and everything. We'll do like some episodes where, we, you know, we do shots of pop or anything, but just keep it fun and light. That, like different kind of stuff. Um, different games. We got a game that we're going to play with you guys called uh, uh, Convince Me I'm Wrong, which okay. will be fun. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, and we're just going to do different things. Dad jokes, all that kinds of stuff. Drinking games with dad jokes. Just all sorts of uh, fun little stuff. And different stuff. like brackets and stuff like that. Yeah. Like, yeah. we got a lot of stuff planned. Yeah. You can check out the Dad Pod uh, Instagram. We're going to, starting tonight, we'll set up a countdown until our first episode. Uh, but anyway, we do got a game for you guys. So, Derek, how um, do you think? Oh, yeah. Here we go. Yeah, let's fucking, let's go. Like, I'm always good to beat somebody's ass in a fucking, like, man, get... <laughs> Is well, this something that's winnable or is it like, opinion no, based? It's winnable. No, I, any even if it was an opinion based, Mikey, still win. I mean, there's still, still winnable. DJ right? Khaled. <laughs> 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 All right, we got pads. So what do we got to do here? All right, so we're gonna do uh, on the screen first. Yep. Okay. We're the gonna do first, uh, the first. One. I think it is. Uh, I think villains. Who, yeah, who's the worst? Yeah, the movie villain of these, but you people. didn't think they were a villain, right? Yep. Yeah. So we like we have like four people on the on the screen, and there's movies that you didn't think they were villains, but I definitely. And you'll have strong opinions. Wait, so of how yeah. do you? So how do you? Like so how do you like score? I guess. Oh okay. yeah, yeah. So so we're all gonna like rate ourselves like so one through four, right? Okay. Right. There's, there'll be numbers there's, on the screen. Yeah. There's there's gonna be numbers on the screen. Okay. So and let's then, pull them up on the screen real quick. Yeah, so yeah, when we can see it. Okay. Uh, the first one's what villain? Yep. yep. All right, let's see. All right, Who is so the biggest th- 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 those oh, are wow. movie villains that you don't necessarily think they're villains. We're gonna all rate ourselves, like yep, we're and, gonna then we're, and, and then we're gonna have a conversation. We're gonna and reveal it, it. Yep. And okay. then we're gonna reveal it. And if you can convince me that I'm wrong, and whoever changes their vote, you're the winner. So you all put right, them so in order wait. from. No, worst worst villain, no, 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 no. All, all I want one. you to do is one. just okay. who you just think is the, the worst. Love so, it. So the and worst, this is what we'll do. And I'm so going to get... the I'm biggest a- villain? So, so just for the listenership, because I have to explain for the people that aren't watching. So on the screen right now, we have um, we have John Hammond from Jurassic Park. Yep. We have Jenny from Forrest Gump. We have Rose from Titanic. And we have Grandpa Joe from Charlie and the Chocolate mm-hmm. Factory. Now, so what we'll do is we'll all write a number. We don't show each other yet. And we'll reveal at the same time. And okay. then, so what will happen is I'll, we, I will make my case for a minute. Mike, you'll make his, you'll make yours. And, you know, Odd Man Odd is going to lose on this game, right? So, like, say all three of you are one and I'm a different one. If I can convince one of you, then it's a draw. See, we. So, we're going to do a shot for whoever's yep, the odd wrong, man the odd man out first. Right. So, okay. if anybody has the matching, the other one has to do a shot. Then we all plead our case, and then we'll do a shot. But, man, who's right? the biggest villain? All right, wow. go ahead. Not who do you not like I didn't the have most. to fucking think Neither about it. You didn't have to think about it? Not at all. Either. <laughs> this one's tough, isn't it, TJ? No, I'm I'm stuck between two, man. I'm you know, I'm I'm I know, I know what it is. Five, I'm not oh, even looking. Four, three, two, one. What we guys go. got? Alright. I got two. Okay. I got four. Jenny. Two. Three. I don't know if you guys can see it on the thing. I'm the only one who's four. Two. I got two. Jenny. I got Jenny, too. Um, All right. All right. Drewski so, has, what do you got, three over there? So you yep. got Rose from Titanic. So I want to hear from has, both, both the, couch, the, the, the both Couch lost. Boys. Yep. I want to hear Couch Boys. You can go ahead and get it first if you want. I mean, <coughs> I don't want to say Why any, Jenny? I don't want to use any derogatory term. Nope. That's okay. But... <laughs> 
she was just the way she treated Forrest was terrible. And to ever use anybody, male or female, as a backup, fuck you. Fair enough. Fair enough. Okay. Yeah. I, I the word that I come up with is toxicity. Can I just toxic. say one thing on your yeah. point on Jenny? That would have been oh, productive. Well, well, no, oh, with, right. TJ there. with with Jenny, like it was toxic. Like it was like every time, um, like Mikey kind of said, every time uh, there was a trial and fail, who was she coming back to, right? Mm -hmm. But she also didn't re ever recognize that like Forrest went through all this shit. For her, that's in modern day, we call that a toxic relationship mm -hmm. where somebody's always doing the most and they don't even want much out of it. You know what I mean? She climbs in his bed when the, when the thunder and lightning happen, right? Yeah. The rain happens. Thunder buddies for life. She, she, he's running but because, she you know what I mean? It, like she, yeah, she gave up the seat at the beginning. So you're like, oh, Jenny's fucking cool. And then it's like every time after that is usually a fucking Jenny problem. When it matters. Forrest, that Forrest is, is fucking jumping in to help out. To oh, I'm going to destroy this. You know what I mean? Let's right go. Now. Let's go. Are you going One to thing that we forget about I? Jenny. One thing we forget about Jenny is... Toxic. Her her dad abused her yeah. her whole life. Yeah. Uh, her quote to, go to bed. is the only reason he ever did anything right. Yeah. Run, Forrest, run. The only reason he was ever great is because of Jenny's words for him. He would have never ran out of those damn braces if it had not been for Jenny. She's actually kind yeah, of the Yeah, but when, you, when she said run, you know what she could have said? She could have turned around and started knock if you Book. She could have started fucking fighting motherfuckers. Yeah. She's used to getting her ass beat, all right, from her dad, stepdad. Yeah, so she and should abused. be tough. So she ain't tough. She's like, runs, she, she runs should be to tough. the tough guy. Hey, and those what, are, hey what, what about when she had AIDS and then she still slept with Forrest? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. 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 We didn't know a lot about I mean, it at those times. Like, yeah, I mean, she yeah. knows she didn't know. that she Thank got you. fucking AIDS. She, didn't know. she, knows she's, she knows she's sick. Th that's she not, like, she that, that's not like a villain? That's a villain. To me, that's not like a villain because she also is the only reason he ran and became. How is that not a villain? She didn't know she had 100%. AIDS. She that was is. abused as a child, and she left for us. And you don't know baby. right and wrong. I mean, I well, I, was, I feel saying, bad for that. The, that's then, terrible. Then, he comes she, back. He comes back to, just right in the life. She it's realizes his her kid. life. It's his kid, and he's like, you know what? I forgive you for everything without saying it. My Under, kid. Hey, one hundred percent. But she also was there for him. She didn't want to also Was die. she? she wasn't I, when was she ever there, there she, for him? When she grew out of the stage where she was going chasing the bad guy because she was... When she had you, nobody bro, left she knew is that, and she had wait, AIDS Jen, Jen, whole life, and was dying. Time out. Time out. She didn't know she had AIDS. <laughs> she didn't know about it then. Hey, Jersey. Also, hey, I, might, I might be on their team right no, now, dude. Because wait, listen. <laughs> hey, wait, bro. Wait, wait, is this a team thing? Like you guys against us or not? No. Well, no, no. no. We we'll make our bases yeah. because well, you guys thank get you for having our back there. Yeah. You guys are convincing me. Convince me I'm wrong. Convince us about number four there, buddy. A hundred percent. I'm like, I think I have the best case okay so who, so, so you want to go next then yeah grandpa joe okay 100 percent. number four why La so? a lazy motherfucker <laughs> That's yeah. got. tell me grandpa joe ain't i, I agree no right? i agree with hey you. your family is fucking like struggling like charlie his birthday and you, he th this dude's like running to get a fucking chocolate and then he's gonna split it with the whole family and you're taking part of the chocolate dude <laughs> come on and this grandpa's like laying in bed in the second, the golden ticket. Boom. Now my legs work. It, it, but is he the only one? Bro. I've always had a problem with that. Yeah, your legs have not worked at all. But. And then the second you see a golden I'm ticket, your legs work? No. Get, get out of here with that. Don't. I would rather a lazy motherfucker than somebody fuck me that has AIDS. But you didn't know you had it. You didn't know you were sick. You keep sitting on that. Okay, what about all the other shit she did? We're talking about Grandpa Joe right I'm now? Talk, I'm talking Listen, about like, Grandpa hey, Joe, but... but, but, ima but ima no, imagine you, Mikey. Imagine you. All I'm saying is imagine... Or TJ, perfect. Imagine one of you guys saying, ah, you know what? I'm just too tired. I'm not going to go to work. And then watching your like whole family just struggle and like your kids and everything. And you're like, is he ah, I'm good. I'm good. I'm good. And then the second they hit the lottery or the Mega Millions, you're like... Sweet. Well, did, was My he the only one who got up and danced? Yeah, let's go. Yes, he's a, <laughs> yeah. Yeah, no, yes, the one, his he grandma got up and danced too. No, but, but, hey, they all danced together. Is grandma on yeah, the fucking thing? But let me oh, tell so you they're something. All though. Shit. But okay, but I'm but I'm gonna dispute you on this. And yeah, this is why. Yeah, this is no, why I, I'm with This it. is why I'm gonna say Jenny over Grandpa Joe. Because Jenny knowingly did some toxic shit. Mm. Right? And she Grandpa did it Joe didn't know well, his legs were. Hear me out. No, hear me out. She knowingly did this throughout the entire movie. 
okay, so Grandpa Joe, yeah, he had his moment where he was in the bed, and then he had his moment where it's like, oh, so you're not you're not fucked up. But he didn't stop Charlie from being what Charlie was going to be with the chocolate factory. He didn't stop the show. Jenny fucking stopped Forrest's show so many times. Forrest mm. is the hero because he's just resilient, and he'll just keep fucking running through but these walls that get put up. Because she started putting up walls when they were younger. But hold so on. he got used to but running Grandpa through walls. Jo- but at least Grandpa Jenny. Joe didn't hold hold Charlie back from this. doing anything. Can I say something? What about Grandpa Joe when he was uh, in the... Uh, Bad the 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 burp uh when he flies up well, yeah when, yeah Almost when they're doing Char- the, when Charlie. they're doing the soda and he's burping and they're going up into the fucking uh the ceiling that's your best argument right there yeah is because he, he my like, thing is refresh grandpa, my memory about that scene. oh so they had like a soda where they could drink I remember and that. they burped and they went up into the ceiling but there was a fan and he almost lost Charlie and the opportunity to win the chocolate factory Wonka told him don't do it. No. So Grandpa Joe well, is... That was everybody in the movie. Yeah, but... Right. Gra- That's but, what it's about, yeah. But yeah, but I'm saying is Grandpa Joe is a lazy ass. <laughs> and, and he's a fucking deviant, dude. Right. Like, what are you doing? Okay. He now told we're going to talk about the wait, 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 hold on. Are we supposed to be voting, by the way? No, no, yeah. Yeah, we are. Okay. We, are we are, we are. Oh, everybody gets their point and then we'll and vote. Okay, okay. Number so three Drewski? is by far the worst of all of them. Everything Jenny did, she did in that same... In one quick boat ride... She already did what Jenny did. She cheated on her husband, 100%. She had an engagement she was perfectly happy with, and then she met Jack. Yes, she was. She, she wasn't happy, happy with him. I'm with you. I'm Not with at you. all. She never said Come she on, wasn't dude. happy with him. You can see it all over her face. She, she looked at happy. Jack like he was a loser at first, 100%. Do you remember No, the movie? she never. Yes, she, she looked and was stars also, in her eyes. First of all, she got naked on, for Jack at a time where you don't get naked for nobody with your Yep, yep. She wanted to draw him like one of his girls. She just wanted a fucking sketch. Anyway. And that was one of the first tits I ever seen in my life. So she's a hero to me over here. Hey, artist boy over here. Also, Worse. Yeah, <laughs> she, didn't she didn't. Let me she, get into it. She, she didn't. She didn't uh, you guys are full of shit. I got two points to make. For one, she knew who her husband was, so she knew how he reacted. Jack. She first almost caused him to die right at the beginning, right? Because they chain him up downstairs. They chain him up. They handcuff <laughs> they him to die. the banister when the boat's going down. They he's did. Tied up. Yeah, they did. And where were all the security guards the whole time? They're chasing Jack. That's uh, not everybody. Rose's fault, though. She knew who she fucking. She cheated on a guy, and that she knew how they he was. Locked now, her wait, boyfriend up. But who's? Hold on. But oh. oh do you have another you, point? Because I don't oh want yeah, to cut you off. I'm going wrong. Go She's okay. the worst ever. Okay, so now now everybody who's chasing Jack, the whole crew of the boat looking for Jack. Got to catch this guy. He's a piece of shit. We got to catch him. Guess what? They could have been out looking at the fucking waves, seeing the iceberg on, on the horizon. She sunk the Titanic. Titanic. Not even the hey, same thing. She sunk the Titanic. I said, there's somebody but I ain't done. His job is to fucking watch icebergs. And he was looking for Jack. Bro. No, he wasn't. He wasn't, wasn't looking, for he was looking for icebergs. He was looking for Jack. icebergs was fucking not looking for icebergs. Hey, can we agree that Jack. John Hammond didn't do anything wrong? Nah, he, he, no, he was, a, he was a dreamer and a believer, and I fucking, I, I commend that man. Yeah. But, but he, he didn't know that shit was going to go left. Rose, we're not going to talk about the end. Two points at the end of that movie. We're not done yet with Rose. Rose got a laundry list of fucking issues. What about when she could have... None of them have been valid so far. All of them have. She sunk the ship. We won't talk about it. She didn't sink the ship, bro. Hey, hey, hey. Uh, a captain ran into a fucking iceberg. How is that, that Rose? That, that's that's was looking for Jack. That's not him, Anybody could have noticed that. Now, I'm not the done The captain yet. wasn't what looking for Jack. The, what about on the water? There wasn't a room for two on there? Now, you can say they disproved this on Mythbusters. They did. Uh, I could, we could, we could survive on this table. If this floated, we could both. Keep There's zero chance. Above it. There is Listen, zero chance. Maybe this is a bad You example. and I are floating on that. Yeah, you got a big head <laughs> singing that name thing. But listen, there's zero chance. Do you know that that was a big old thing? They could have held each other, and their upper bodies would have been on the water. Yes, they might have got their legs chopped off. Hold on, wait a minute. Wait a minute. Now, wait, it gets worse. Time out. Time out. I got. I got to debunk you on this. There is no factual thing in history that that can prove. That Rose and Jack were floating on a fucking door. Okay. Why don't she get on there's the boat? Never, she there's didn't even nothing in history that's been able to prove that. She could have got off with the movie. So that's for the story. Wait, 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 that's wait. for the story. What are we talking about? She could have got off when the women and children did, and that would have been all his door. He could have got on the door by his goddamn self. What do you mean? And now the third issue, door. the biggest issue with this bitch, <laughs> what she did at the end of the movie, right? The heart of the sea. Oh, bitch, no. <laughs> the heart of the sea. Hey. Hey. hey, her family. You know, she could have ended world hunger with the heart of the sea. The biggest diamond you ever. What'd she do at the end of it? World of hunger. This bitch throws it into the ocean. That's, hey, that's gives the it back to Jack. I've ever heard. Are you out of your mind? Hey. People at home will tell me this bitch. She did everything that Jenny did. That Jenny was. She wasn't abused. She was just a rich girl. Wanted to live a fucking fast and lose. How do you life. know she wasn't? Huh? How do you know she wasn't? There was, she was rich. Hey, how do you know hey, she we gotta wasn't vote. abused? We got to vote. She wasn't abused. You don't know Let's that. Let's go. We got to vote. 
I ain't changed my mind. All right, so what are we voting on right now? All right, so, no, so did, all did of us anybody, have to it, vote on did who we agree with. Convince you? Yep. Did, did make anybody, anybody, anybody convince, convince me? Yep. Okay. And did you just vote the same thing? Yes or no? You can even no, pick John Hayes. No, 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 the same number. Put your number back down. No, yep. any oh, number you want. Okay, so put no. the number that you now believe. Yep. Yeah. Yep. Yep. And if you wanted to say John Hamm, which is crazy, okay. you could technically. You could be like, you know what? I've been wrong. That guy made dinosaurs. Okay. One, Everybody get one, two, three. Yeah, me and you're taking oh, another shot. I still have. I got two. With the still. light, I, you can't two? see yeah. it, but you guys are picking. I got I still two. Have two. Child okay, of go. abuse. I got four. Two. I got three. Again, I still have two. All right, every, it's clear. So everybody you guys kept don't theirs. Have to. You guys don't have to. And write in the comments how right I am, people. You're not right. Uh, you're no, right you're right. not right. But you know what I, you know what I like about Rose this game. Great. So, so uh, you sucks. know what I do like about this game, and I'm really digging it, is that you, it's okay to change your mind. Like it's okay to have somebody yes. convince yeah, you yeah. of something different. You don't yep. have to always be right. You know yep. what I mean? In this instance, I, I still thought that number two. I can't believe you think Rose. Is a bigger piece of shit than Jenny. You're insane. Jenny. To me, she sunk the boat. She sunk the boat. She sunk that. the boat. She sunk Jenny, the Titanic. She knowingly Heart of the sea. had her thrown away. Like, come on, man. She didn't know. Nobody in the movie. You guys are making up facts. You don't think Jenny knew she, like, she wasn't healthy? She knew she was healthy? Sick. She just knew she had the flu. She wasn't healthy. Like, well. Listen, the, flu a lot the last statement I have, I'd rather support a lazy piece of shit oh. than somebody fuck me that has AIDS. But if she didn't know... You know what I mean? Hold a grudge yeah. forever. What if you she she could have saved your life? She sunk a boat and she threw away a uh, hundred million dollars into the ocean just because I killed a guy. How about this? Hold on, she killed a guy. Hold on, let's sum it up right here. Let's sum it up right here. So you've had this crush on this girl since you were a fucking little kid, right? And every time you try to holler at her, she she'd get close enough to you for you to fall in love with her, and then she fucked you. But TJ, all she's ever known is abuse, so she only knows. Uh, the, the, Look at all the relationships she has in the so movie. How many, they beat the so, shit how out many, of her. so how many excuses are you gonna have in life? <laughs> For yeah. something bad happening well, to nature you. Nature versus nurture. Okay, so something happened to you in your life, right? And I feel for victims, right? Victims. If something victim, happened. Victim. But what I'm saying is, it's not an excuse 10 times in your life. Forrest was a victim, it's only four too. four times. Yeah. Forrest was a victim. Yes, thank His you. His mama was up. You don't remember Come the scene? Come on, now. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Let's go. His mama was fucking for school clothes, oh, bro. She was oh, fucking Mr. Now. Now. He them. lived in the biggest house. He lived in a goddamn, I think it's a plantation. I'm still trying to figure Wait out. Wait a second. Is it a plantation? I will say that. I'm still trying to figure out how they're in that big ass. Yeah. Uh, yeah, is it a plantation? Is she's it? Got, she's got to fuck West, people for good grades. Yeah, this, she and Forrest ain't shit. All right, and the only reason he ran is because of Jenny. Forrest, Forrest ain't had shit. trauma and was a victim, and then he overcame all the trauma. Because of Jenny, tell him he's run. got purple so he hearts. Right and wrong. What he, fuck did he shit. say, Bubba, motherfucker? That's what he and why did he, he say Bubba? Ain't shit. Why did Why did he say Bubba? Because in Jen, Jenny, fucking Jenny in his head, Grandpa over here, Jenny, Jenny in his head, run, Forrest. That's what she heard. She always heard Jenny's voice. Hey, Forrest ain't shit though. Next round, bitch. Yeah. Oh, next Come on, you now. lost. Little You're little taking a shot. Yeah. Shut up. So did you, bitch? You had three. I did. Four. The words the B word is getting thrown around. Please do not call me the B word because game I, does I, get not, I, I am from a different, different culture. I just want to say that right now. <laughs> <laughs> I do not. Let's see so this next good. one, you So we're good. Okay. So the next one, we'll, uh, we'll throw on the screen. If you, get, if you guys, well, you want to... This Same one is game. your favorite uh, a favorite device. Any kind of magical device. Oh, any yeah. kind of device. This From a movie, right? I'll, I'll go ahead and yeah, throw it on the screen. Yeah, so like this one. If you could pick one movie gadget with no consequences, which would you choose? And that's the key word. That's the key part yes. of this is which one would you choose with no consequences? Mm -hmm. So what is keep that, that in mind. If you, if you could pick one movie gadget so with no consequences, Men in Black, which one the would Mind you pick? Eraser, right? Yep. Uh, number two, you, the Invisibility Cloak. Fun one. Uh, three, the Click Remote. Uh, four time machine, the the DeLorean. Number five, CB three O's. You have a little uh, robot that does whatever you say. Let me explain this to you because Drewski didn't. So, Mind Eraser is from Men in Black. I said that, didn't I? Yeah, you did, but you didn't say what it was from. Some oh. some of our listeners might not know like without looking at it. The Invisible Cloak I, uh, is from Harry Potter. Um, Harry Potter. Ha yeah, Harry Potter. Uh, the Click Remote is from the Adam Sandler movie, um, which I don't remember what that did, by the way. It controlled everything. He could fast forward through shit he didn't want to see. Yeah, he could pause, pause great okay. moments so and rewind. Anything that a remote can do, it can do. Okay. Yeah, in real time. Uh, DeLorean time machine, Back to the Future, obviously. Uh, C uh, C three PO. I don't know because I've never watched. He's a maid. He's basically a maid who does whatever you say. He he'll do whatever you say, and he's chipper and he talks with uh, a British that accent. That sucks. Infinity <laughs> Gauntlet. 
So that means all five Infinity Stones where a snap of the fingers, you can make shit disappear? Yes. I don't even know what that like what the end game for all five is, Me except either. for a bunch of people well, disappear. Well, but, so each one has a different okay. ability, so mine's still, all of them do. Oh, okay, okay, yeah. okay. I got what you're and saying. And there's okay. no drawbacks to whatever you do, right? It don't just kill you. So like you got Mind Eraser, oh. Invisible Cloak, Click Remote, DeLorean, Time Machine, C-3PO, and Infinity Gauntlet. Okay. Can we have like, can we get like 10, 15 seconds yes. to think on it? Yep. 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 15 seconds starting now. Didn't even need it. Already done. I, done. I need it. I did. Let's go. All right. You knew right away, didn't you? Yeah. Hell yeah. Not even a question. I know what you guys are picking. You I, got I same? can bet without seeing it. Mike? Huh? Yeah, same. Probably. I think you guys do. I would bet my life. It's definitely. Well, actually, it could be one of two things for you two. Excuse me. Okay. Oh, bless you. Are we all good? Thank you. Bless you. We one, all good? Two, three, one, go. two, three, go. I got four. Six. Four. Oh yikes! Let's I go. got three. Four. Four. I knew, four. Six. Three. I knew. I got click three. Remote. I knew click remote. I knew it. Let's start off with the uh, table boys over there. The big, the fucking big Let's wig go. bougie fuckers with the eight mile on their table. Yeah. So you want to go first? I'd say. Go so. on. I got four. Let's hear it. Let's go, Derek. All right. I got four. Let's go. DeLorean. Fucking let's go. Hey, I'm changing whatever you guys want to do. I'm changing. Like, I'm going back and forth. You hey, go you don't like lottery? it? Lottery? Yeah. You don't like it? I'm going back. Hey, I'm not sure about what you're doing. Going there. Well, I know why TJ did it. He's, he's going back to last week's episode. I like that. No, I'm yeah, saying like no, that. Like, I like, like that. Whatever, whatever you guys want to do. Like, I get you. If you had, like, your situation, like... Oh, sweet. We're going to do this. I'm going to go back. I'm going to change it. Oh, I get that. No, say, go, let's go to no, oh, the four. Let's see. You're, you have some reasons why you pick four, too? So, same kind of reason, but, like, with the DeLorean, out of all the out of all the gadgets that are up there, right? Like, and, and oh, So, this is what I did. I did process of elimination with this one. Like, I didn't fall in love with any of these right off the bat. I had to do process of elimination, mm-hmm. and I'll explain why. Mind Eraser, that sounds creepy and Rufalin-ish. <laughs> I agree. 100 percent. 100 percent. Any one of us would have picked that out. Agree. Agree. Yep. Agree. Yeah. Like, Agree. Mm, Agree. We're not even gonna do that. Yep. Yep. We also already talked about uh, um, on an episode of what would you rather be, uh, either fly be able to fly or be invisible, and I picked to fly. I invisible was kind of like the same thing. Like, eh, I mean, not as creepy, but I mean, what does that do for me, right? Um, so the remote is is a little tricky because with the remote yeah you could fast forward you could rewind all this different stuff that doesn't mean you can necessarily change like if i'm watching a movie i can't change the ending of that movie with my remote Mm -hmm. you know what i mean so i'm kind of like okay well that's all that does is just fucking you can only change in the movie you you don't have to have a memory because you can always fucking rewind you can change what you did in the situation is all he can do but he can't change what you would do so usually it plays out the same way yeah that's okay usually yeah uh, yep. four, so I'll skip four. I'll save that for last. Uh, five, CP3O, a maid. I don't fucking need that in my life. I just don't, and I'm not a big <laughs> Star Wars fan, and I... Same. You know, whatever. Infinity Stones, the first thing that pops in my mind is when he fucking snaps his finger, everything is gone. There's a tragic situation and all that, movies. dude. Like that. Uh, now, like watch them for movies. For now, <laughs> that brings me to what I picked was number four because, I mean, it's a time machine. Okay? There's, there's no consequences. Right. There's no... There's nothing about it. Like, nobody says you can't change things. And after we've seen that movie, like, things can change. Now, it might be a butterfly effect. And that's, that's to me, that's okay. Because I can keep going back in time. Keep going back in time to fix things. Or see, I can go to the future. You didn't see Back to the Future 3? Where he fucked up the future. Did and anybody Biff, see Back to the Future 3? Biff was in charge oh, of the world? Him. Fuck Biff. <laughs> Biff Tannen was in charge of the world. Like we mean the turd. I mean, listen, dude. I'd have Air he Max on. Uh, first of all, first of all, first of all, if I pick four, that means I I think I can get the, I can snatch the Air Mags from uh from uh, uh what's his name uh Biff the, the no the main actor ja- Jamie Marty McFly Marty McFly yeah. the fucking Air Mags that he had in his feet the futuristic oh, yeah. shits that yeah, that the people yeah, at Nike yeah. made for him like yeah, uh, bro those went for big money by the way anyway. It's not about the shoes, but that's why I picked four. It was process of elimination. If that's not a good next explanation, then I don't know what to fuck. You're about to get wrecked. And that's be, after it, drinking it a lot of eight four. mile. I'm with you. You guys are going to get wrecked. But Michael ahead, J. Mike. Fox, that's his name. Yeah. 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 Yep, yep, yep. Hit, you, hit, it with, hit us why you picked three. Hit us with your best shot. Mike. Dude, because you guys said it wouldn't change anything, right? Or there's no, like... There's no consequence. There's no consequence. No consequence. So I felt like Time Machine, like I was going to go pick four, but then Time Machine, like 
it is the butterfly effect, so it would always change. Right. So how many times are you going back and forth to try to make your perfect scenario? With the button, I could I could pause stuff. Like, right in April, did something sweet. Rewind and experience it again. Yep. I mean, April's first time to California. Rewind it. Like, I think about it all the time. Okay. My favorite time to California. That's it's our first time. Yep. I can that's live it again. Good. Damn. I don't awesome. know how much I'd use fast forward, but pausing, like... So this is where I was a little skeptical. Like when you pause, is it as everybody froze pause? Mm-hmm. I mean, you're so that, not. You're not. But, but what if you never, never made game. a mistake and you wanted to like reverse it? And I wanted to make a mistake. Yeah, like no. What if you ever did? You want to reverse it? You can though. Yeah. You can in that movie. It so just, if you rewind, yeah, you're going back in time. So you're you're, you're going you're, back you're in time. You're basically like like well, you're not we, reliving we it, right? No. Yeah. So because you, in that movie he rewound, but then he could do something it. different. Yeah. So uh, so there it's was like a time machine. Him, right? So it's the same, right? If it we is if kind we of, rewind it, it, it yeah. has more options. It just has more cool. options. The now this is where you guys don't know movies very well because if you knew <laughs> number six. <laughs> has a time stone. So you already control time, except you don't have to do all that other funky shit. You don't have to get in a DeLorean. You just do it. You just click your fingers, go to any point in time you want. Now, also with this, okay. Mind Stone, you can do anything you want with the Mind Stone. You can literally tell you that you want to think something, change any moment, and change people's idea so you're of the mind moment. controlling then. Not only, it gets that, worse. That's not cool, though. Uh, I'm just saying, th- there's no consequences, bitch. Let me finish. There, also, there also, there's not only there that, is. there's the Reality Stone. You can literally make it, rea- any reality. If I, if I had that stone situation. where I can so, make it go back in time, I would make it go back so you don't call Derek a bitch right there. Yeah. yeah he's just acting like a bitch. Mm. Anyway, the reality <laughs> stone. I could like be like, I don't like the way you guys are picking the wrong answer here. Reality changes. Y'all pick six, the right answer. See, I could literally change reality. <laughs> I can't wait to eat you up on this. I can't wait, but I'll the time, you So you have time, reality. You do have one that you didn't want to use, the, the power stone, or it just destroys anybody, but no enemies. So that's not... Like Rick calls it a broadcast. See you, Rick. You could just fucking destroy people. If you ever did that, <laughs> you'd be so. I would hate you. <laughs> yeah, but I change reality and your mind, so you wouldn't Dude, hate me. You wouldn't even know I did it. That's. I don't. I, I'd have all the power. That's why. You, you I don't can't, even like thinking of, that. That's. Hey, listen. You could be a good person or a bad person, right? So it depends on the person. Obviously, with saying it, you could be bad, like Biff Tanner okay. with the time machine. He stole the time machine, wrecked the world. Right, he changed the entire future. Click before he got it right. Right, he was fast forwarding through all those little moments he would have missed out on. You know what you'd be? You'd be Jenny with the Infinity Stone. Yeah. God, you would be. You're Bitches. toxic as fuck. Yeah. Dude, you yeah. guys got bad attitudes. Think of all that. I po- feel like all it. that power. Bad attitudes. Who is this fucking dining? Again, I would change this reality. I would change this reality. <laughs> you got bad attitudes. You got bad attitudes. Your, your mind is reality. You something, dude. When he's being an asshole. <laughs> Also, though, I don't even know what I was going with. here's an you example. Know exactly where I was going with with it. that, you could literally click your fingers okay. and change the whole outlook of the world. You could end world hunger with a click of your fingers. You could literally do great things. None of these other things can end world hunger with a snap of your fingers. None of them. Not a single one. I'm going to tribal vote and I'm putting my final answer down. Yep. Hell yeah. The right answer, you okay, so bitch. now we vote again? <laughs> yep. Tribal. I like that you call it tribal council. <laughs> I like it. You got me kind of pumped up. Yep. All right. I wish we had a game for the game. We could uh, save yourself from getting voted out because so far, <laughs> getting voted out. Let me know when everybody has their final answer. Good. Wait a minute. Whoa. Whoa. Oh, he had a breakthrough. <laughs> had an epiphany here. So on my click remote, right. can I only rewind my life? I can't go back into other like time no, periods. Only your life. You can only rewind. No, you, not, not, he's changed. No, that's what it was. That's what the movie was. He never went back to dinosaurs. He only rewound it to like he was a baby, and then he was like, "Oh shit, I gotta go forward." Zzz. Remember, he was like, "I can't go back that far." Okay, tribal has spoken. Yep. God, okay, dude, I gotta fucking now. I gotta change it again. God. Damn. The only thing that we changed about the quick moment is the consequences of like it was like T- Timo, TV, TiVo, TiVo, where it started having a mind of its own, where things it thought you would fast forward, it fast forward through. TiVo. Yeah, Wasn't Tebow. Yeah. So that's the only thing we changed. No consequences. That's another thing mm-hmm. that got swept Damn. under the rug. Ready? All right. One, two, three. I got three. Four. Four. Oh, I'm on four now. So you went to three. Yep. I went to four. So I had four. You got a trick shot. Three. I, I stayed on four. six because it has the power of all those stones. It has the best. I went to four because I can go to different types. So me and you got to do a shot. Yep. 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 Wheels cool. up. Mikey. <laughs> Is it, did you have four the whole time? Yeah. But uh, so because I can go back to me and April so, riots, and then I could also go back to me Capone and do some business. Yeah, but you can't pause it. 
And also, but, you're you're there still. The reason no, I went with what you take back. I had like a sentimental moment there, and the, and you said something. I was like, man, that fucking like. I was just thinking like the like memories and everything. Just because like where I'm at in my life, everything happened for a reason. Like yeah. I could change some things and make my life ten times. I don't want to change that. I want to experience different times. I get that, but but you had convinced me with the three, and you were explaining the three, where I'm like, dude. I I am grateful for every experience. I would probably even rewind bad experiences to fucking learn from them. You mm-hmm. know what I mean? Yep. And yep. like I feel like if I went back in time with the time machine, the DeLorean, I wouldn't be able to help myself but to change something. Whereas if I'm just yeah. rewinding, yeah. I'm just rewinding. Well, that's the thing yeah. we're, we're missing yeah. about the DeLorean is you're you know always I mean? back there. Like you can when you rewind to the past, you're not just jumping into your spot. You're, you're back there every time he went it's back. Back yeah. to the future. Right. He was always there though. Like he was in the future when he went back in. But he can also go to the past too. Remember when they were on horse? Yeah. Like, what was that number three? Or that's number three. Three. three yeah. yeah. It's because he had to go fix his mistakes in the second one. Yeah, yeah, that's what I'm saying. Like if you can go like correct. The but guys, you did wrong. Right? I know, I know that it's a lot of power. Yeah, but, but you know good. what? Though? I kind of didn't want. I kind of like was like, like even with the Infinity Stone shit you're talking about, Drewski. Like number six, Infinity Stones. It's like I can control too much. And what is life if you can control everything? True. You know true. what I mean? No, I'm with true. you. Like, the, the experiences hey, hey, aren't the hey, same. Hey, hey, you're spitting, but let me say this: like the fact that you could no, that, end that, suffering that, across deep. the world. Like yes, you'd have a lot of power at your fingertips. That's true, and you could become a bad person like oh that batman quote like everybody's a but even until if you they want become to be a, a villain. good person but you like it's too much control like it's not enough living when you can control everything you're never you're yeah, not living mm-hmm. i get what you're mm-hmm. saying you're but not having a real it, life it, experience like, i guess for me since i don't have like a uh, relationship or kids like me thinking that i could be like no more world hunger boom no more war boom and that's and then, yeah, like, no, I, I mean and that's suffering that's and sickness, good shit. And, like in these places yeah, where it's yeah, yeah. rampant. Boom! Oh, earthquake just happened. Not anymore. It didn't like you could. Yes, your life would be tougher for sure because you'd be watching shit happen. Not like like you said, not learning from your mistakes but because the there is no mistakes. Of life, mm-hmm. But then you got to think about the imbalance of life. Oh, it's super it, for you, you know to be miserable. You'd you be, save be miserable. everybody. Guess what yeah. happens? Guess what happens? Now there's mm-hmm. another problem because you've saved everybody. Yep. It's just like uh, what's it called? The man who gonna become when Jim Carrey becomes God and he says Andy. everybody's praying to hit the lottery. He goes let him hit the lottery. Or, or um, Andy, not Andy. Um, I forget what it is. Bruce Almighty. Bruce, Bruce Almighty. Almighty. Yes. Yep. <laughs> Where he like you yeah. know he's God. And yeah, he, yeah. It, it isn't great for him. Mm-hmm. And people are complaining still. They find a reason to complain. Yep. So are these the type of games that are going to be yes, on the Dad Pod? Yep. I yep. like this, man. I like this. This is fucking dope. We'll probably we'll probably all four be on another episode one day together on that yep. one, uh, playing a game, a full episode. Love but you we're guys. also gonna do conversations like have other dads come on so that he could talk to them. You know what I mean? It's not I think just that, the I think drinking. that Drewski should always like be in the corner, like being the only person that doesn't have kids to oh, yeah. yell out For random sure. wild yeah. shit that he just doesn't. <laughs> yeah, yeah, Drewski. Yeah, yeah. To have an, <laughs> make you guys a little bit sometimes. An opinion. The, the, the non dad yeah. heckler. Yeah, to have an opinion. Just, on just to dad show shit. you how much of a dad he is not is <laughs> yeah. last yes on the '90s episode when I almost choked to death. <laughs> yeah. TJ had to yell at burp the baby. He didn't even know to fucking pat my back. Dude, hey, listen, he just know. sat here and watched me. Hey, listen, if you're going to die on pod, that's going to only boost a rating. <laughs> yep. <laughs> Sorry. Yeah, maybe. Yep. <laughs> oh, my God. That's taking one for the team. That is. And, hey, I, get, and I was going to let you do that for us. That's how good of a friend I am. I was going to let you say how committed I am. <laughs> All right. But anyway. Guys, I had so much fucking fun on this episode, man. I, I cannot, Derek, I cannot thank you enough. And I think I speak for all of us. Like, we cannot thank you enough for the opportunity you've us, given us for sponsoring us and uh, enable us to get the studio, for coming out here and, and having a conversation. And like, this game was dope. It's something totally different than what we usually do, man. I've, I've had a fucking ball. Like, for real, for real, man. Or I, so. I think I speak for everybody, man. Or like, you guys are genuine, and we we love it, man. Keep keep doing what you're doing. Like keep 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 every, keeping on. I, yeah, <laughs> yeah. Like what what do you say, Drew? Like oh yeah, hang loose, hey, hang loose. No. yeah. But hey, you guys you guys are awesome, man. Like we all love it, and we can't wait. We to love you, brother. Appreciate, appreciate you so much, appreciate man. Thank you, you guys honestly. Like, thank you, and we can't wait to crash your adjusted health. Yeah, coming soon. Adjusted health appreciate chiropractic. It. Yeah, so very, very shout out to uh, Adjusted Health Chiropractic. Shout out to Dad Bod Podcast that you got coming out. Yeah. Dad Bod. I said Dad Bod. Not Dad Pod. <laughs> Dad so Bod Podcast. <laughs> <That's> perfect, baby. <laughs> <laughs> the Dad Pod. 
the dad podcast, man. Um, and this is laying your plane podcast, fellas. Uh, I've had a great time. Uh, Same. Anything anybody needs to say before we get the fuck up out of here? I think Drewski can send us off here. Catch you later, boys. <laughs> Wheels up, fellas. <laughs> <laughs>